May I come in, sir? Come. Thank you, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Mm. Please sit down. Thank you, sir. Pooja Malani? Yes, sir. Okay, please tell us something about yourself. Sir, my name is Pooja and I come from Jaipur city of Rajasthan. I have done my graduation in BSc Physics Honours from SSN Subur College in Jaipur. And last year on the basis of Civil Services Exam 2022, I was allocated to Indian Police Service and currently I am on EOL. You are on EOL? Yeah. So you have not uh, undergone any training? Yes, sir. That shows on you. Yes, sir. <laughs> okay. Uh, so, the Indian Police Service is not obviously not your choice, service, uh, uh, service of choice. Uh, sir, it, uh, IPS is a good service and I really feel privileged and honored to be a part of such service. And it was my second preference after IAS. So, right. I am happy to have it but I want to try for IAS. Do you think that if you don't uh, make it to the IAS? you will be satisfied or you will write the exam again till you get into IS? Uh, so as currently I am on EOL and I have intimidated the academy that I will write CIC 24 if I am not going to clear in this attempt. But ultimately if I am not going to make it to IS then I will be happy and satisfied in IPS. All right. Okay. Uh, you come from Rajasthan. Yes sir. And your subject is sociology. Yes. Rajasthan uh, women related reforms, all for women uh, related reforms started from Meera's day, Mirabai's days. Yes. Sir. Na? Satina Hosea, she said. But how come even in Rajasthan the child infanticide, yes, uh, then child marriages are the most? Yes. Why so? Uh, so there are multiple reasons behind the child marriages in Rajasthan. Uh, first reason as it is obvious socio-cultural landscape in which people uh, follow certain rituals and they get their, uh, get their daughters married at an early age. Second reason is of economic. Uh, now there are two aspects to the economic reason. First aspect is that uh, their concern is that when their daughter is at young age then they have to pay less dowry. And the second is often observed in tribal areas that people exchange their daughters for the debt burden and when we when the administration is working for the child marriages then this aspect often goes unnoticed so i think uh, we have to notice this concern as well all right uh, rajasthan has international border with pakistan yes sir how long is the border uh, sorry sir i have to read about that okay that how many districts are on the borders uh, sir, currently I am unable to recall. I need no, to just apply, take yes, take a moment, think rationally. Which are the border? Which are the districts of Rajasthan on uh, international border? Uh, so one is Jaisalmer, as far as I okay, know. Okay, one. So unable, I am unable to recall. You are unable to. All right, you are in Delhi. Yes. Sir. Right. If I said that fetch water from a Rajasthan river that comes to Delhi, which river would that be? Sir, river from Rajasthan to Delhi. Yes. Uh, sir, I am unable to... All right. Okay. okay. Thank you. Okay. <clears throat> Pooja. Yes, sir. Pooja and Aradi. Which one is better for God's blessing? Sir, Pooja and... Aradi. Pooja or Aradi, which I should do for blessing from the God? Uh, sir, Puja, is ba Puja basically means the worship and devotion to the God and Aarti is a manifestation of it. Uh, so I think both go simultaneously when we are worship our offerings to the God. Okay, okay. Manasarovar appears in your dash. Yes, sir. Where is Manasarovar sir, and how is, a, is it significant? Uh, sir, it is a lake in uh, Kailash, uh, Kailash Himalayas and it is of religious significance. Uh, it is a pilgrimage, pilgrimage site for Hindus. Only Hindus? Uh, no sir, for other communities as well. Which are the Hindus. other religions or communities? Uh, sir, other religions, uh, sir, as far as I can remember, the other religious communities also have Mansa was significant. Which, which one? Islam? Sorry sir? Islam? 
क्रिश्चियनिटी सर इस्लाम इज वन ऑफ दैम और बुद्धिज्म और जैनिज्म ओके ओके यू थिंक ऑफ मानस रोवर ब्रिंक ओरिजिन इट इज ओरिजिन ऑफ सो मेनी रिवर्स व्हिच आर द रिवर्स सर वन इज ब्रह्मपुत्रा एंड सर इंडस रिवर और सुनो सर सॉरी सॉरी इंडस सर ब्रह्मपुत्रा इज आई रिमेंबर ओनली ब्रह्मपुत्रा ओके व्हाई इट इज पुत्रा अदर रिवर्स वी कॉल ऑल विमेन ओनली ब्रह्मपुत्रा इज सन why is it why is brahmaputra such a which is special status gender status uh so i need to read about this okay 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 let us come to uh rajasthan jaipur is a smart city is yes. it a smart city uh yes sir it is covered under smart cities mission whether it is covered or not is it like singapore Uh, no sir it is not like singapore but so singapore. let us make jaipur to singapore what are the points you will take it as dm uh, yes sir uh, sir jaipur is facing multiple issues which we need to address in order to make it a what smart are those city issues? yes uh-huh. sir uh, sir first is the issue of traffic in sir has told you sti smart city will not have beggars and all okay come come to the uh, yes, sir. code Uh, so first issue is of traffic in the area of Parkota. So traffic area. integration. Yes, sir. Traffic How do management. you traffic physics and chemistry of physics and what is the other subject? So maths. Physics and mathematics. Let us use for traffic a better traffic in Jaipur. How do you use? Uh, yes, sir. So using uh, physics, uh, physics uh, enables me to use different technologies as, and we can use the technologies What like AI. What technology? Yes, I am sir. asking you. Huh? Yes, sir. Technologies like AI. Uh, AI. AI. What part? AI means it is uh, like yes, a uh, elephant. You tell me which yes, part of AI? Yes, uh, sir. So the data analysis of okay. we can do predictive traffic management. We can analyze the choke points where the traffic is more and the reasons behind those. And uh, with the data analysis powered by AI, we will be able to. Okay, let us go to border safety in northeast. Suppose you are posted as DM in Kuki, Maithi conflict area. Yes. Sir. What will you do? Uh, sir, regarding borders, border safety or the whole. Border safety, safety as well as this conflict, yes. ethnic yes, conflict. Yes, sir. Uh, so first of all, I would like to assess the reasons why particular conflict is going on, and uh, then my effort would be on uh, on the priority basis. First of all, I would like to stabilize law and order in that region with the help of security agencies. Uh, after that, uh, relief and rehabilitation efforts need to be uh, brought out so that uh, the what uh, when it is often seen that whenever the conflict situation arises, then a governance deficit is created. between the people and the administration and my efforts would be on bridging that deficit for that we can uh, we the administration can take proactive steps by engaging with locals as well as community policing initiatives can be taken and for the part of border safety we can equip the security forces with the updated technology and those <coughs> equipments okay. like ai drones for proper surveillance okay thank you thank you sir. <coughs> so puja yes sir. uh What is the literacy rate in Rajasthan? Uh, so it is around sixty-eight percent, less than the national average. So you are a anti awareness campaigner. Yes, sir. So, do you think that the literacy level in Rajasthan is adequate, or is it required to be improved? Uh, sir, it requires to be improved as compared to its population. Literacy rate is less. So, uh, you know. the political consciousness among the people in rajasthan yes sir. is relatively higher when compared to the rest of the people in the country though literacy rate is low yes. so how do you see this situation yes sir uh, so i think political consciousness depends on other factors uh, as well rather than only sole dependence on literacy rate and those factors include that uh, rajasthan has been a feudal social setup so from earlier times itself people are more aligned towards the political representatives and sometimes the reason can be uh, reason can be bad for also reason can be bad also as uh, people tend to get aligned 
with the caste and religious concerns when they are not properly literate and educated about these. So these are some of the reasons. Uh, despite implementing a very good health uh, insurance scheme, yes, Chiranjeevi Swasthya Bhima Yojana in Rajasthan, so why the people have changed the government? So there can be multiple reasons behind it. Uh, maybe they have, uh, they may have liked the election performer of other government or other party, or so there can it can be individual reasons. They can be individual reasons. Did you vote it this time? Yes, sir. Uh, to which party you have voted? Uh, sorry, sir, I can't disclose it as it will be a confidential. Okay, fine. Uh, your father is a street vendor. Yes, sir. So, what are the provisions of the Street Vendor Act of 2014? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, so, there are multiple provisions of the Street Vendor Act and it is on the part of the states to implement that. <coughs> the first is so, that municipal bodies in the state have to create separate vending zones for the street vendors uh, so that they are not facing uh, multiple encroachment uh, drives which are going by the administration. Second is that uh, vending committees have to be created which have representatives from the street vendor itself. So if any policy decision is coming from the administration, then they have then this uh, then that had to have to come with proper consultation. And third is that uh, the state government has to take steps to provide them subsidized credit for the upliftment or the increasing the scale of business. Thank you, sir. Uh, <clears throat> Again, street vendors. Yes, sir. What does your father sell? Uh, sir, my father used to sell the daily wear garments. Got it. Now, one of the major problems faced by street vendors is harassment by the police. Yes, now, sir. your father is a street vendor. You might become an IPS officer. Yes, sir. How will you show more empathy and understanding as a police officer towards the problems faced by street vendors? Yes, sir. Uh, so first, I would uh, I would assess the situation on the ground uh, that what is uh, what is actually going and how, what are those police officials or which are taking uh, any bribe or harassing the street vendors. And after that, I would initiate a community policing initiative in which street vendors would be uh, street vendors would be encouraged that if any police official is harassing them, then they can complain against it against them. We have a district police complaint authority, but to make it more localized, I can make, I can uh, initiate a police complaint authority at the municipal level. Done. So that all right, all right, all right. Now, you have done something about the Right to Education Act. Yes, sir. Now, Right to Education Act, uh, what are the sociological and psychological implications on children? Of Right to Education Under the Right to Education Act. If I understand the act correctly, that students from poorer families can study in better schools, yes, in some kind of a quota system, yes, correct? Sir, yes, sir. Now suddenly you find children from weaker sections studying in a school which is so-called non-weaker sections. Yes, sir. Now both sets of children will be impacted because they are children. Yes, sir. Correct? What do you think are the implications? Yes, sir. Uh, so of this mismatch, there can be multiple implications. Uh, first is the difference in the, as uh, as I come from the sociology background, uh, then a difference in the reference group. Uh, for example, the reference group of uh, children in uh, which are from non-weaker sections, it is different and uh, the weaker sections are having different reference group. So this is which, the duty which, of... Which reference groups are you talking about? Uh, so reference groups like uh, the the children in non-weaker sections are looking towards uh, certain career opportunities like they have to become doctor and engineer but if the education is not imparted inclusively to the children of uh, weaker sections then this create this can create a psychological barrier that they can Done. agree my last question uh, both because you are already in the police service and second because you are a student of sociology yes sir now certain laws are very peculiar if i attempt to commit suicide and I die, then I die. Yes, sir. If I fail, I am sent to jail. Yes, sir. What is the sociological perspective of this? Should suicide, attempt to commit suicide remain a criminal offence? Uh, sir, in the recent uh, amendments, the I am asking your opinion. Okay. Uh, sir, I think su uh, attempting suicide should not be a criminal offence and efforts should be done to reintegrate the people who have uh, sacrifice the society in the society okay. again. I'm just connecting to that. 
30 seconds. If I have the right to life, do I have the right to die? Uh, yes, sir, we have a right to die with dignity. I didn't, did I use the word dignity? No, sir. Yes. Sorry, sir. If I have the right to life, do I have the right to die? Yes or no? Uh, sir, yes. I think yes, you have the <laughs> right to die. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Yeah, Pooja. Yeah, suicide is agar yeah, acceptable so many in problems so in Rajasthan. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm? Yes, right? Suicide acceptable. Yes. There are so right many social problems also in Rajasthan. <laughs> if you can come up with one major problem, yeah. what would it be? For Rajasthan. Yes, just one major you problem. Can karna take, you. you can take your time and answer as a student of sociology. Yes, Uh, so lack of adequate women empowerment. We have to go with the multiple uh, dimensional approach for women empowerment. Women empowerment. Yes, sir. Women empowerment. Yes, How sir. can we empower women? Uh, so we can, uh, so with going with the India's current approach, we can empower women with the women-led development. Mm -hmm. We can integrate them as equal stakeholders in our way to development. Mm -hmm. And for this, we have to work on all the issues which are affecting them. And first is uh, the child marriages in Rajasthan. And second is the Sarpanchpati phenomena, which is often noticed even after the guarantee of reservation to the women. And not only we are empowering women in, of Rajasthan, if we are successful in this or on these efforts only, we, the indi health indicators and other socioeconomic indicators will also increase. As women will be educated and under Asha and Anganwadi scheme, they can be employed as change bearers. So, they can change the whole society. Okay. Pooja, you just discussed about women reservation. Yes, sir. Women have reservations. Yes, right. Sir. Do you think there should be double reservation for Dalit women as well? As a woman and as a Dalit woman, they should get double the benefit. What's your opinion? Uh -huh. Sir, uh, I will go with more targeted reservation rather than going for double reservation. The existing reservation can be implemented in the more targeted manner. How? Elaborate. Uh, so, for instance, whatever the reservation we are having for ST category, uh, that can be made more targeted by looking out what are those structural facts. First of all, we would identify what are those sections of women which are still underrepresented, and what are those structural factors which are blocking their way to, uh, to the administration or to the politics, and then addressing those structural factors and then coming, uh, taking them to the reservation benefit would be more beneficial. Okay. Coming to your extracurricular activities, yes, you sir. have mentioned poems. You yes. write poems. Yes, sir. Any recent poem which you wrote? Uh, yes, sir. I wrote a poem on child sexual abuse. Okay. It is a story of a survivor who fights can back. Can you recite yes. some lines? Uh, yes, sir. I can. <clears throat> Uh, so the title of the poem is Survivor and it goes like It's his birthday but he is sad Thoughts in his mind are making him mad Contradictions between what he learned and what he felt His body has turned into an ice block which refuses to melt He is afraid to step out, he is afraid to play For his PT teacher he has become a toy of clay That devil touches him wherever he wants It's a sign of victory for him and shame for victim he flaunts the child hates himself for being so vulnerable. Suddenly, he stands up and says, let's turn the table. Gathering, uh, gathering his broken pieces with all the courage he had, he reveals truth and reveals all those marks making that devil mad. I have done nothing wrong, then why should I be blamed? It is this devil that needs to be shamed. I am a survivor and not a victim, he exclaimed. The crowd behind him cheered and clapped. It's his birthday and now he is glad. Excellent. Thank you. Beautiful. Yeah, Thank it's you. It's not she, it's he. Yes, sir. I intentionally... Beautifully. Yes, sir. Very beautiful. Thank you, sir. Thank Very you, sir. beautifully written. Thank okay, you, my last question. My last question. Yes, sir. Uh, which came first, poetry or prose? Uh, so I, so I can make a guess. I'm not exactly sure. Okay. This. So I think prose. Are you sure? So I'm not. Uh, sure. On what basis are you making this uh, guess? So I think uh, uh, first of all, people would have started uh, expressing their feelings and thoughts in the form of long, uh, long paragraphs and sentences, and then poetry may have come. Okay. Till Thank they you suffered. Till they suffered. As they say, Vyogi hoga pehla kabi. <laughs> Thank you. Thank anyway, pass on the chair. Sir. Okay, Pooja. <laughs> uh.
so we are done with you uh, as far as this mock is concerned yes. how do you think you fared today uh, sir it was not well i need to brush up on many things like so first of all on rajasthan i mean on daf i need mm. to work upon all right so you know the problems yes sir okay uh, what did you score last time so 180 180 yes, okay uh, so there are few things uh, yes. as you as you mentioned one i noticed that you uh, while you are answering or sitting in front while answering you shake your total upper body shakes okay sir i don't I know why okay but there is some shake anyway uh, and secondly is you are in a hurry to respond you are in a hurry to respond like uh, he was talking about mansarovar and you jumped in immediately and uh, yeah hai na so just uh, just uh, think about it and uh, when is the interview so 7th march 7th march yes maybe in terms of speed your speed you are very excited girl <laughs> so <laughs> it could be <laughs> so actually maybe speed, it could be a bit yes, slower in <laughs> so i have uh, last time also i was receiving this feedback of uh-huh. fast speed but i tried slow speed but it happens that when i tend to go slower i forget what no no then you, then you continue you are <laughs> you are very good so you should continue mm. with the, what you uh, do so you have the experience so for the interview you will go in a suit or a sari uh, no sir i will try a sari will you will try a sari okay then you know they all the things i need not repeat only thing is you are very good just because now you got into the ips there could be questions on internal security considering yes. you to know whereas you are an eol and you are yet to yes, become sir. don the uniform and another thing i noticed is that you mentioned that about your eol uh you have intimidated to the authorities intimated, intimated or intimidated <laughs> yes sir, as all the batchmates were discussing that we have to so that the questions will not come on training no you have to intimate not intimidate not intimidate <laughs> okay so that word okay sir okay so you mentioned intimidated so i i knew that it is uh, mm. so it was a tongue of slip slip of slip of the <laughs> <laughs> and <laughs> <laughs> don't don't worry puja don't worry you are way too good okay yeah, very good. you are very good and uh, let's hope you make it this time all right yes, huh? <laughs> any questions you no sir i'm okay because i'll work upon oh, oh, nice. okay. very good excellent very good Thank enjoyed uh, interacting with you so all the very best you have right. a very pleasant personality yeah. right Thank very you. simple very very nice very natural so Mm. Maybe right. And you argue well. They reason well. Mm. You uh, the uh, ground realities of uh, certain issues is outstanding. So yes, that very young also, very young. Hmm. yeah, all the best. Thank you, sir. All the best. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. All right. Bye. Take bye. care. Bye.